Ladies and gentlemen, you are looking live at a bunch of black people in Pine Needles, North Carolina, <laughs> at Pine Needles Golf uh, and Lodge, uh, yeah, Golf DMV in North Carolina, the trip we've all been waiting for. We're in a room full of people. I think everybody's having a good time. Is everybody having a decent time, a good time, or? Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, okay, all right, looks all right. like everybody's yeah. having a good time. Oh, by the way, uh, Lawrence just informed me, because I didn't know, that this is show number 300, 300. for yes. Golf DMV. So I'd like to congratulate yes. Golf DMV and all the Golf DMV people mm -hmm. for 300 shows uh, uh, with uh, on radio and, yeah. on, well, I guess we went on radio for 300, podcast no. for 300, mm -hmm. radio for somewhere around mm -hmm. maybe 183 or something, something like, like that. that. Yeah, yeah. I got to do the math. Yeah, we'll do the math and YouTube later. about 12. Yeah, maybe 12 years. <laughs> maybe 12 years. This will be one of them. Yeah. Many, <laughs> many of the supporters oh, in this room. By the way, by the way, yeah. shout out to uh, Lou Naylor with Where's My Meeting yes. or Where's mm -hmm. My Meeting dot com. Uh, you can schedule your AV um, and hybrid meetings, uh, in person meetings, yep. online meetings. They're going to take care of all things uh, AV for you. He's got all kinds of stuff set up. We've got mm -hmm. a screen where we can actually see, see ourselves. ourselves. Yeah. Um, but the problem is, is that if you look at the screen, then you're looking away from the cameras. Yeah. And so you look weird you on look the screen weird. if you're looking at, at the screen. Right. Uh, we've got yellow lights. We've got white lights. We've mm -hmm. got you rotating got 800 cameras. feet of cable on the floor. We've got cables. He brought a <laughs> lot of stuff down. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> no, so here's the thing. So, so before we was coming down, Lou sent a text like, hey, you know, I want to bring some stuff down, do some video work. Like, yeah, sure, absolutely. But the warning was, you know, be careful not to pack too heavy. Right. Because we will disappoint you. It'd be like it's not going to be worth you, worth you breaking. All this stuff. But I hope it's not disappointing for him. Lou, I hope not. Thumbs up, thumbs down so far. Everything's right. good. Thumbs good. Okay. Yes. Where's my meeting dot com. So let's see the way the rounds uh, breaking down. Oh, by the way, we'll talk about Alex and Beltway Golf later. Um, uh, the way the rounds are breaking down. Uh, Southern Pines. Yes. Uh, tobacco Road, Tobacco mm -hmm. Road, uh, Pine Needles, yeah. mm -hmm. and then Mid Pines. Mm -hmm. Okay, so Tomorrow. four rounds, uh, I guess in five days. Yeah, um, you guys started at Southern. I wasn't here yet. For me and Coach weren't here yet. Right, for mm -hmm. right, right, right. Uh, your thoughts on Southern Pines? How? Because again, the thing about it is, is that people say you either love it or you hate it. For Southern? Yeah, for okay. Southern. Mm -hmm. Oh, no, that's Tobacco that's Road. That's Tobacco. Tobacco's either. Yeah. But so Southern just got like redone. It just yeah. got renovated. Yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah. Southern got redone? Yeah, two years ago. Two years really? Ago. It's still, it's still growing in. Wow. Okay. Yeah. Because it looked very... That's why. It looked very pedestrian Yeah, that's to why. Me. It, okay. It needs time. All right. Yeah. 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 Okay. So with that yeah. knowledge now, mm -hmm. I mean, it, it was like in 2021 when they just completed the, uh, the finish with the really? renovation. And it takes courses uh, like three, four years. When you, okay. When you say renovation... Full that, tear down. When you, oh, again, <laughs> when you say full tear down, yeah. are we talking like... Tearing out the fairways, yeah. putting the new greens, yeah. that kind of stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, because it looked pretty trashy. Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> the greens had right. sand on them for a reason. Oh, okay. They're very firm okay. and hard. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. it, it, it looked like a bad municipal. Yeah. 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 Okay. <laughs> was a lot of people in the room looking at you stunned. I mean, Glenn rolls his eyes. He's got his hands no, up. No, I, I mean, I'm, like, I'm open to a different opinions if yeah. someone differs. By the thinks, way, you guys you know, know how we do, like when we do these shows with everybody here. You just pull up to the chair if you got something you want to say. It's You don't have to schedule it. You don't have to be quiet in the room. Do whatever you want to do yeah um and then you can add your comment whenever I think, you want i think it. bad municipal is strong because we're like we're Sound, now, now, sounds strong. now we're in like gunpowder territory southern hills is better than that right um or southern pines is better than that uh but yeah you could definitely the greens were tough because they were super hard they're very firm yeah. and they had sand yeah. on them so the ball it would roll true but then if mm -hmm. you hit like a sand patch it would get kind of squirrely yeah like that. So, and it, it wasn't very consistent either because yes. it would be power that's true you know what that's half true. of the you know, part of the green has a bunch of sand on it, another part doesn't. So you you put through this part, it's slow. You put through that part, it's yes. fast. Yes. And it was it was a mess. It was a mess. LB, name a muni back home that you'd rather play than Southern Pines. Any of Montgomery County ones. Oh, that's tough. Needwood. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's tough. That's, oh, that's, that's I don't know. Be uh, because okay, again, no, 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 no seriously, no. Let me finish we, this we, point. We mess with you, but but well, no. uh, okay. Yeah. The one thing I would say about it, okay, and this is and this is indicative of the North Carolina courses, yeah, where they do a lot of the uh, was natural terrain, yeah, the waste uh, areas, the waste and, yeah. areas, unkept. You know, I like my stuff manicured. You do right, and <laughs> this what we which talk is about? why you don't like Pineers number two. Well, yeah. what's what's the name of the course we talking about now? Southern Pines. Southern Pines. Pines. Southern Pines. Very similar. Com yeah, very similar. You know, no manicuring. It's just grass, and when it stops, it stops, and it turns into dirt and sand. Yeah, you know what I mean. So yeah, <laughs> and that's yeah. not what you like. Now, Vern, because yeah. again, I didn't play. Yeah, your thoughts on Southern? Uh, he's right about the greens. He's right about them being 
uh, uh, tricky and, you know, the, the bar rolling true. Inconsistent. But, inconsistent. There yes. you go. Mm-hmm. But uh, as a course, I thought it was fun. As a course, it was fun to play. I think it's a good opener. Mm-hmm. If you come down here uh, and are going to play more than – if you're going to play it and other courses, play it first for sure. Don't, like, play pine needles or tobacco yeah. or something. Play Southern Pines first. It, w- it was a good um, opening. Yes, Opening course, and we had driven down that morning yes. too. So I was I was tired. Yeah. So maybe that impacts my <laughs> perspective. That's probably also because that. I we got a, Rick Rick made me late, and so <laughs> then we get to the course. I got I got twelve. <laughs> yeah, it was it was your fault. We got twelve minutes to warm up and go tee off. Yeah. So I got no nap in. You know what I mean? It was a, it was a mess. So yeah. that probably jades my perspective. Yeah, I think as a it, for those. Actually, like listening, it's like oh, Southern Pine trash. It's not like the bones of the like when this course grows in, like maybe probably next season, next well, two the year seasons, after. Yeah, yeah, it's gonna be is it's gonna be really nice. There's some great uh, approaches, really great holes. Uh, a lot of the greens are elevated. Mm-hmm. Uh, if you watch in the YouTube, you'll, you'll, is that a Donna video. Ross design? The elevated uh, greens. Yeah. Was, was that a Donna Ross design? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. there you go. There's your problem right there. Yeah, yeah Lawrence yeah. is not a fan of. He's Donna not a fan. Ross. Of Donna I don't even Ross. repeat the no. text that he sent me. Yeah, because it's just not necessary. <laughs> It's very not, disrespectful. It's not safe for work. It's just not. <laughs> no. We don't need, we don't need Suffice it. it to say, uh, you can hit a, like, 90% good shot, mm. and if that's not enough, if it misses by just a little bit, it's you gone. can be punished, like, mm-hmm. to the max. Like, yeah, you think, right. maybe you think unfairly. Yeah. But mm-hmm. uh, Email me, folks. I'll tell you what I think of it. Well, uh, <laughs> yeah, if, you, if you'd like to. Um, so, just out of everybody in the room, I mean, a show of hands, how many like Southern Pines? I mean, it's like, all right, yeah. All right. Yeah, see, that was a half. Okay, no, that was a got, half. He gave a half. You know what I mean? I he half gave a half. half. Okay. See, that's a negative. Thank you, wow. my man. See, me and Lou are on the same. Right. We're on the same page here. See? Okay. Mm-hmm. All right. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, there's no need to continue talking about that. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> number, Moving on. Day number two uh, in Golf DMV in North Carolina, we played Tobacco Road. Yeah. Yes. Start um, with the hands on this one to see. I'm yeah. Curious. Mm-hmm. So I'm oh, sorry. Say that again. Start with the show of hands on Tobacco show Road. Hands. Who, yeah. yeah who all like? Who like Tobacco Road? Let's do a show of hands. Show of hands. It's got one, two, three. All right. I'll, I'll put mine up there, too. Okay. I, right. I like Tobacco more, Road. More hands yes. up more like, uh, yeah. So, you know, I'll start. So, Tobacco Road, not in, not in like, yeah, as far as the way the course is laid out, but it reminded me of what we say about, like, Little Ben on Laurel Hill. Like, if you're going to go there, get ready to fight. Because yes. every single shot mm-hmm. and every single hole is going to be a grind. Yes. Um, I think, I think what hole was that, Ver? Because we played together. It might have been, was it eight? Or 16, yeah. the one that I just kept raving about. I mean, it was hard. Oh, 16. 16. 16. I mean, to me, that's 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 my that's the, my favorite hole in all of golf that I've ever played in my entire life. And Glenn, this Glenn, week, Glenn, yeah. yeah, this yeah. week. Yeah. 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 Now, anybody who knows me knows no reason to bias at all. That I, that, I, that the last course that I played is my always my favorite course, and and so I get it that I fall in love fast. Oh, what is that Usher song? I love love. I'm just bad at it. You yeah, know, I've yeah. got bad habits, and so but like. I, I, it, it was the placement. I mean, because you, you've got to, you've got to, it, you've got to hit it down to this little valley or whatever. Yeah. Then you're going up to the to the um to the green. Right, turn left, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. I mean, it's just so much strategy in it. So well, that's that two tier. Oh, everybody, let's stop the oh, show, Rick everybody. Says, Rick says it's a birdie yeah. hole for him. <laughs> yeah. Rick said it was a birdie. Yeah. Yeah. Send your checks too. Although I will say this, <laughs> in Rick's group that day, there yeah. was some controversy. Over a birdie on 18. <laughs> I think Troy said that he got a bird. <laughs> I think it was Troy who, uh, you know, we was over there, Vern's counting up all the stuff because there's a little bit of money games going on. And so Vern's counting stuff up and yeah. Vern's like, okay, Troy with the 18. <laughs> With the birdie on 18. Rick says, wait, what? <laughs> says, there, there was some, it, it kind of reminded me of the, uh, of the, of the what was that, the, uh, the, the Moonlight and uh, what was the other Ryan Reynolds movie? The the Oscar the Oscar drama uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh, uh, where they had the wrong card because like he said oh. Birdie on eighteen and I see whispering in the back between <laughs> between Rick and my dad like this been, ladies and gentlemen there's been a mistake. <laughs> <laughs> He's like ah uh, Moonlight won the Oscar yeah exactly yeah, it's so, not a Birdie but um, anyway uh, but yeah I mean. I, I like Tobacco Road, but it's 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 going to be a fight. Like it's not going to be I like Laurel Hill. Like yeah. it's not you know particularly gonna... the back nine for those of you who want to play. It. Like the front nine is still you know the front nine is like typical Mike Strands. Mm-hmm. A lot of blind shots, but there's open shots. fairways. When you get to the back, it gets ridiculous. I mean right. not not in not in a bad way, but it, it, 
It gets crazy. Like, 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 like I said, it gets crazy. And here's, and, and here's the thing. Like, I don't think I would make that the first course you play when you get down. No. Here. No, 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 no. Please no. don't. Like, each, you, need, you need a night's rest before you go to that. For sure. Wait yes. to Tobacco mm-hmm. Road. For sure. Uh, mm-hmm. But I like I like, I like it, though. Vern, yeah, I did. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I like Tobacco Road. Again, there's no – it looks more uh, – uh, save for some of the holes in the back. Uh, I think it looks more brutal than it is. One, two, it's a course that, like we say this a lot. You know, of, that's an actual, that's a really good point. Yeah, it, it mm-hmm. looks tougher than it actually than it is. Then, then, yeah, it and, will intimidate you off yeah, the tee box. Yeah, yeah, it, off the tee box for sure. And again, just yeah. like all the other, just like the the Ross courses, if you're bad off the box, you will pay mm-hmm. <laughs> because yep. with the waste areas, you will pay. Mm-hmm. But uh, I told Claude earlier, I imagine there are some men's leagues that are members of Tobacco Road that compete there every week with no issue or irons because mm-hmm. they just know it. So yeah. I feel yeah. like this is like yeah. a lot of the courses we talk about, Pag Noon, some of those other ones we've been on where once you once you've played it two or three times. Right. You know where to you know you, where to miss. Yeah, you yeah. know where to miss. It's like, oh okay, mm-hmm. I got it now. By the way, as we're recording this, some high school football game is on. Some kid just ran it down to the two yard line. There we go. Yep. Yeah, a mm-hmm. team with red helmets and an H, H on it. Yep. Uh anyway. Let's go. <laughs> let's, let's call them Houston. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Houston. <laughs> Houston High. Okay. Uh, anyway. <laughs> so. But yeah, no, no. Fun, fun, good, good time. Yeah, uh, it's, a, uh, it's it's a beautiful course. It, it really is. it really is pleasing to the eye. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Okay. But mm-hmm. what did you think about I mean, how did I'll, well, he's he's not Donna Ross, so I loved it. So you, yeah, <laughs> um. <laughs> right. now I will say this too. Leading up to it, I've been talking about how the fact that I haven't been able to play and get out and practice. Now I had done my binge thing, where yes. I'm like, okay, going to, gun go powder, to the range, going yeah. to gunpowder, mm-hmm. doing what I got to do. Um, you know, wasn't expecting much, but it's so funny how like I can I know that about the situation or the state of my game, but then still expect more. You know what I mean? It's like, yes. It's just weird the way golf does that to you. Yes. You know what I mean? But you, but as frustrating as it can be, I, I feel more times than not, you leave, no matter how you play, feeling optimistic about something. Yes. Like I'm leaving the room where I'm staying and I walk out and these guys who are in another room, they're on their balcony. It's two older guys and they're talking about, and all I heard them say was, you know what? All things considered. Yep. We weren't putting as bad today as we normally did. That's and golf. It's like, yeah, and it's like, I mean, the scores were horrible, but the, we were putting better today. Yeah. And it's like, that's exactly what golf does. You have to find something. You, got, you, mm-hmm. have, hang your on something. you have to find something you to, hang, crazy to hang your head on. You go crazy if you don't. Yeah. But yeah, yeah, Tobacco Road, I love I love Tobacco Road. Yeah. You know, yeah. no, nothing bad you know, uh, at all for me to say. The staff was really good, too. I thought the staff at Tobacco yeah. Road was right. really Yeah, yeah. Pull mm-hmm. in, like, as soon as yeah. you pull in. Uh, cart mm-hmm. station right there. Yep. Uh, driving Drive range, range is right to the everything. right, and then one is right off that. Yeah, mm-hmm. so yeah. And I highly recommend that you stop at the turn and get a drink. Okay. And All say right. hi to the lady who's working there, and I'll leave it at that. All right. That must have been Southern Pines. No, that was the Tobacco that was Road. The tobacco. Yeah, oh, okay. Tobacco Road. Mm-hmm. All right. Cool. Got it. Yes. That was Southern. I'm that sure. was Southern? Yeah, that was. Oh, yeah, Southern, okay. I'm sure. So she was the highlight of Southern. Was it called Southern Hill? Southern Pines. Pines yes. Southern Pines. So she was the highlight of Southern Pines. There for we me. go. There you All right. We got there. So yeah. then later on that evening, uh, <laughs> we made our way to the Carolina <laughs> Hotel where yeah. Yeah. we stayed the last time we were down here yes. playing at Pinehurst. At Pinehurst, yeah. yeah. Had a great mm-hmm. dinner. Yeah. Um, yeah, that was fun. Uh, and and so then I guess well, the next day we played Pine Needles today, yeah, which is uh, today. where we're staying, yes. yeah, mm-hmm. which is the time we're recording. So we don't have anything on 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 Mid Pines, but um, I like Pine Needles a lot, yeah, mm-hmm. a lot. So far the favorite. The weird thing is, is that it doesn't look like a tough course to play at all. No, but you can find yourself in some trouble. And I think I think I may speak for almost everybody in in the I think I mean most who I remember or <laughs> or spoke to about it that the front nine. Very pleasurable on the scorecard. Yeah, back nine gave out beatings. Yeah, and like I mean, yeah. it was like you know everybody <laughs> like yeah, this on the front, blah, blah, blah. and then we get to including myself. Yes. I mean, and like got tore up on the back on the back nine. Yeah, yeah. But the course, beautiful shape. Mm-hmm. Um, you see everything. Something one of one of Troy's phrases is the course is right in front of you. Yes. Troy will say two things about a course: either the course is right in front of you, or the course isn't in front of you. And so those, <laughs> those, are, those are Troy's two, and not two. That's his two, two opinions. Yeah. <laughs> every yeah. every course that he'll play is it's in front of you or it's not in front of you, and so you got to figure out which figure one's out what which. You're doing Troy it. actually hit my driver twice today. And, you know, I'm. I get awkward in, in situations like this. Remember, there was a, <laughs> the hat situation. <laughs> we years ago, yeah. Rick asked me, "Can yeah. I try on your hat?" Yeah, and I, that made me awkward. So I just gave him my hat. I was like, "Yes," and I'm not a socially awkward person. <laughs> like usually, I can handle myself in these situations. Right, can, I, right, can right. I see? Can I try on your hat? I've never been asked that before. Like, right. 
yeah, sure. So I gave him the hat. And then Troy was like, hey, can I try your driver? And that, but usually I don't play with lefties. Yeah. Right. And so, so there's issue. usually yeah. no one know what asking to do. me. Yeah, mm-hmm. so I don't know what to do. I'm like, right. yes. And so I'm trying to figure out whether, am I being taken advantage of? Or like, I don't, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> am I getting jumped yeah. No, he's just asking, can he hit with your club? He wants yeah. to Things see Things that it. righties do all the time. And so mm-hmm. the second time that Troy asked me yeah. <laughs> to hit with my driver, <laughs> I, I held his driver yeah. and mm-hmm. swung it a few times in practice. Like, what well, should I now? Am I now obligated to ask him mm-hmm. if I can swing with his? Yeah. Like, I don't know yeah. what to do in these situations. This became a whole thing in your it, head. Yeah. yeah. And 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 it's obvious and it's nothing. Yeah. But did you? Did you try his? Because he, no, he has a no. PXG. Yeah. No, I'm not. No. Yeah. No. I didn't do that. Yeah. God, no. I didn't that. I've been seeing him hitting that driver all day. I don't want any of that bad mojo. <laughs> but um, no. Anyway. Uh yeah, so <laughs> your thoughts on pine needles help me? Yeah, I I enjoy pine needles. Um, I thought I was surprised at the elevation changes. Yeah, on you thought it on would be flatter. Needles. Yes, I I, I yeah. anticipated it being much more flatter than it was. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I thought the layout was pretty. Um, it's 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 a Donna Ross course because he did this one too, right? Yeah, uh, he did. Which is surprising to me because I liked it. Yeah, and he actually he actually designed it. Yeah, but but maybe it's I the, love Glenn's reaction to things. It's because like, yeah. they dressed it up for TV. I think that's right. why you like it. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. It, it it has it still has that resort f- feel to me because it is somewhat manicured as yeah. opposed to the other ones that look like you know they just let it do what it's gonna do. You didn't like yeah. it. Yeah. yeah, no, but I enjoy I enjoyed this one. I enjoyed this one. I enjoyed it. and came I played well down too. Here so. Last yeah. year to cover the U.S. Women's Open. Yes. That was held. That here. was held here. Yes. Mm-hmm. Anything different from what you saw with the ladies and versus? No, no, it's that? all the same. Minus, minus all the billboards and people. Right. Okay. The same right. course. No, mm-hmm. I didn't see anything different. And to be fair, when I when I came last time, I didn't want to do all the walking, so I only saw probably four holes. Oh, because okay. <laughs> okay. I was okay. deter- I just I was. It was so many people, and and <laughs> okay. you know I didn't have in- and see they didn't give me inside the rope access here. Yeah, see we're so, used to inside the ropes. Yeah, I, I I come for privileges, and I didn't get any back. privileges. Yeah, yeah. so oh. I didn't I didn't do a lot of walking because. I didn't have privileges. Well, so. now you got privileges. You paid money. Now you got to walk. <laughs> yeah, now, now I saw the entire course. Yeah, so yeah, yeah, I, yeah, there are some holes I kind of wish I had seen uh, the pros play. Yeah. Um, now, but yeah, that was then. That's now. So yeah. all right. And Vern yeah. did. Uh, yeah. F- favorite of the of the three so far is what I thought it was going to be. I watched the flyover that the USGA put up on YouTube more than a couple times. Uh, was watching some highlights from the US Women's Open just to see how they how they played it. Um. Yeah, I really like it. Like I said, like LB said, it's just like a really uh, manicured and like sort of majestic Donald Ross course. Obviously, Pinehurst number two is for us as well. But <laughs> but but um, for it to be not that long, Donnie Donnie will get you, bro. Like what a lot, yeah, like yeah, like sure. like the approaches are always there in all of his courses. We played from six thousand. We did play from six thousand, but, but it, it felt it, longer. It, it whooped. Yeah. I, I'm, again, I'm not gonna speak for myself. I feel like it whooped a lot of our tails in this room. And what if, for those who want to come out and hit it. Don't be, don't, you're going to see it and be like, oh, this looks like it, like Troy said, like it's right in front of you. Here it is. If, if you're inaccurate, this is weird too, because I guess at Pinehurst number two, I don't feel like this was necessarily the same, but if you're inaccurate off the tee a little bit, you can still kind of lose your ball oh, in some of these little yeah, yeah, thorn yeah. thickets or yeah, these yeah, little yeah. thick, like yeah. I'm talking about, we had, I think Claude, yeah. Claude and I both had drives where there were slight pulls. So we're talking about like edge of the fairway. But you'll take them anywhere. Yeah, anywhere like, yeah. else at home, mm-hmm. you're good. Here. It just it goes down like right on the edge of the fairway, and you see it bounce, and it just disappears into the ether. And you can't find Probably it. in one of those uh, uh, tuft bushes, mm-hmm. yep. and you're done. Now you now you're down a stroke. So, uh, and I put it off the I put it off a green, which I never thought I would do. <laughs> I never, after making a regulation, tried to finesse it up to the yeah, to the, know, ridge, it's funny. It the ridge. I'm trying to remember the back. who I was, we were talking about this as far as the grain and stuff on the green, and like I never thought that I would have any kind of interest on. Trying to learn what the what what kind of you know grain of grass yeah. is there mm-hmm. and which, which way it's running, but it is super important because I mean there were times where you could just tap the ball and it's running off it's the gone. green, yeah, or you can give it a good stroke and it comes up short, yeah. But it depends on which way the grass is going and whether that. it was just so it was a lot to take in, yeah. When it came to like reading the gr- yes. the greens, um, yeah. But it's but it's plenty fair and you can tell it's uh, I can tell why they had the women's shit like the way it ends with this it ends with this beautiful par four. Downhill, downhill it's short mm-hmm. so it's a to me it's a good risk reward hole where it's like if you bomb a nice drive down there 
you can come in with a good number, mm-hmm. or if you hit through the fairway or you know f around, you're gonna you know mm-hmm. you're gonna be in trouble. So right. I and think the dome shaped green didn't help either. Right. No, that's, <laughs> that's true. That's true. Yeah. That's true. But that's <laughs> again, that's all the Donny stuff. Yeah. But yeah. Uh, Donny stuff, like I know, like Donald Ross course. <laughs> um, but no, I, I like it. I like it. I'm looking. So I think Mid Pines tomorrow is supposed to be a little bit. A little bit tougher than than pine needles, so I'm, I'm oh, curious. Really? Yeah, oh, yeah. Okay. I'm I, curious I to see. I thought it would have been the opposite no. since it's got quote unquote the name. That's what I thought too. Yeah, that's what I thought too. But when I looked it up and you look up the slope too. I think the mm. slope on uh, on mid pines is higher. Okay, uh, it's a little bit higher. So uh, go ahead. No, mm. no, go ahead. Yeah, I was, I was gonna say I I did have uh, you were talking about dinner too. I did right. have a couple of pine earth observations. Okay, like if you're coming mm-hmm. down here, yeah. Um, if you come down here and you haven't been to reg- like if you can go to regular pine earth first. Do that because when we showed up at the Carolina Hotel, mm-hmm. a lot of people who have not been to regular Piners, oh, there was an yeah. immediate sense of like, oh, this is oh, this is where you guys stayed, huh? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Say, yeah. Number one, we're at <laughs> yeah, because we're we're at Pine Needles Golf and Lodge, yeah. or whatever. Yeah. Not yeah. Carolina Hotel. No, it no, is no. Like, and we'll get to that in a second. Yeah. The second thing, which <laughs> yes. I thought was funny, which which Glenn told me was uh, telling other people about the golf trip. Uh, again, we like to be. We like to be condescending about Bandon because we can. So <laughs> been when you when you mention to people, it's like, oh, I've been, or oh, I'm headed to Bandon. It's like, oh, wow, reverence. And then mm-hmm. if you tell people, hey, I'm going out of Pinehurst, the first thing they it's think like, is like, oh, number two, number two. And blah, blah. Yeah, yeah. well, we no, did that last time. We're doing yeah. secondary Pine Pinehurst, needles, and then immediately yeah. people are like, oh, okay. Oh, and I thought, okay. and I thought <laughs> to myself, I could see them in their minds like, oh, you guys are broke. I got right. it. <laughs> you can't afford Pinehurst number two. Okay, cool. those are good courses too. Yeah, Donald yeah, Ross yeah, did them. Yeah. Yeah. If yeah. you go down there and can't play Pinehurst too, yeah, yeah. these are good ones. Or mm-hmm. Pinehurst, any yeah. of those courses. Yeah, the first tee you down there. These are good ones. Is that what it was? No, no, no. So don't let anybody, don't let anybody make you feel bad about it. These courses, I will say this: Pine Needles. Um, having having played number two, I many people who have played it, who have played these as well, like to include the boss golf, have mm-hmm. said like, "Look, man, if you don't have like for the name and history, got it. Number two is great, whatever." He said, "But for way less money, you get the Ross experience, pretty much to a T." Between yeah. Pine Needles and he said Mid Pines, which mm-hmm. we have yet to, to play. To me, Pine Needles is a baby number two. I agree. Mm-hmm. To be honest, with I agree. It's, little, it's number two's little cousin. Yeah. Mm-hmm. All right. So accommodations. No, yeah. Oh, the mm-hmm. pretty. The pretty. Cousin, the yeah. pretty lumber two cousin, or there whatever. How you want to look at that? Because it's much. It's to me, it's much more aesthetically. She pleasing. was on TV, called. Yes, yeah. Yeah. Well, that's right. Two's been yeah. on TV, huh? Yeah. A few times. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. You're right. Yeah. I like number yeah. two. Yeah. All right, so yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so, what, so they put ugly people on TV all the time. <laughs> that's true. That's true. So I guess pine needles is like Solange. Then the closest you gonna get. Right. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> all right, all right. I'll take it. I'll take it. Uh, all right. So accommodations. Um, like I said, not exactly the Carolina Hotel. Not exactly. No. Lawrence has no. strong observations about the accommodations yeah. here at Pine Needles uh, mm-hmm. Golf Club and Lodge. <laughs> oh, and Mike does too. It seems like go right. <laughs> hey, Glenn, go go ahead. I Lawrence. think so. I think we all agree. So one thing we've done here, which which I'm grateful for, and I, I'm glad we've we've done, is every evening we sit out back on the patio and we have drinks and cigars. Very important to Lawrence. Very important to me. That's yeah. why I came. I didn't come for the golf. I came for these guys. They yeah. ain't got with these people. Yeah. And I've enjoyed myself. Thank you. Um, last night as we were sitting there, um, Coach looked to say, "Do you see that over there?" And he pointed toward the wall, concrete wall, and going up the wall <laughs> was a roach. The side. <laughs> <laughs> The size of a golf ball. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just say he was bigger than your average roach. <laughs> a Donald Ross size. Yeah, a Donald yeah. Ross size roach. So, and that was the first one I had seen since since we've been here. So that evening, I go into my room, and uh, <laughs> it wouldn't be the last you'd see. No one yeah. outside. Yes, it was not the last. I, I, I walk in the bathroom and turn the light on. And something scurries across the little counter they have above the above your sink in the bathroom, and I chased it down and finally caught it <laughs> and killed it. And <laughs> yes, it was the cousin of the roach that we I had saw. Outside. We had saw outside. So I haven't seen any more yet. Um, hopefully, I won't see any more. They're game. But, they're, they're game planning yeah. right now. Yeah, they yeah they teaming up on me. Um, but so when you come, you. <laughs> bring, bring, yeah, 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 bring, 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 bring your own OS, bring your own spray. Um, and the these rooms have not been updated in quite some time. Nope. Definitely so outdated, if yeah. if you like paneling, you'll love 
You'll love it. Everything mm-hmm. here. <laughs> See, the carpet, yeah, carpet, the carpet's really outdated too. Yeah. yeah, the carpet yeah. needs to be. I mean, yeah, yeah. it definitely. Everything is. Everything outdated. needs a facelift. Yeah. Now I will. I will give them credit for this. The rooms that the rooms that we have, at least my room, is very spacious. Sure. It yeah, yeah, is yeah. huge for 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 a hotel yeah. resort room. It has a separate living room with a couch and a chair and a TV, and then your bedroom, which you could probably. I mean, you could. I could probably put four queen size beds in my room that's yeah. how big it is yeah um so oh. space is not an issue at all it's just they need to put some money into the updating and remodel basically gut them down to the bricks and start over yeah with all of the uh the amenities of the room okay uh, right. yeah it did yeah. Uh, and again I, I think i had it backwards i said at the top if you're going to do the carolina trip do the pioneers first no i'm going to say it the other way mm-hmm. go from this and then, and then make go your to next Pinehurst. trip to Pinehurst. Because right. I will say, again, and this is probably, this, although, this, I mean, you could always just stay at the Carolina Hotel and then play, and then play, and play anywhere you want to play. Right. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's true. But yeah. you better be down here for a long time. Because the Carolina it, because, Hotel, I mean, it's, it, it, you yeah, know. Yeah, as soon as I yeah, walked in, I was like, oh, yeah. hotel. I remember, like, right. oh, yeah. right. Yeah. It was like this yeah. when we were down here. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. And I think even they updated since we've been down there. They looked like it. They had yeah. it renovated it was just the after. And mm-hmm. like the paint looked fresh. And yes. Mm-hmm. I think even a little cafe thing to the, the rooms, side. All the rooms we stayed in, which yeah. were nice then, then have, have been, been remodeled. Have been redone. Right. And yeah. the price reflects that. Yeah. yeah. And, <laughs> yeah. yeah. and the price reflects that. You're going to pay yes. for it. Yes. You're going to pay for it. Yes. Yeah. But yeah, this place, I mean, the staff, again, the staff has been great. The yeah, sure. starters, nice. everybody doing your bags, all everybody. I have no complaints at all about the staff. It's just the. Again, the, the facility needs, just needs to be remodeled. I mean, it's just that simple. It just needs to be updated and be yeah. remodeled. Anybody, somebody got something to say? No, Anybody? no, no, oh, no. I, no, I actually, I actually no. wanted to get. I don't want to put you on the spot, man. But I just wanted to get like somebody like it's your first golf trip. It's like your, you know, thoughts. Oh yeah, with everybody. Yeah, come yeah, on yeah, through, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. Just come you over and share, share, and, share with yeah. the homies. No, he's. Are you gonna? Like, you gonna yeah, do yeah, an interview? Last member in anyway. So. No, no, man. Yeah, he can sit right here. I'm saying we'll do it. We'll do it. We'll do it. I'll handle my my microphone and he can. What's going on? Hey, man. Welcome, welcome to the show. <laughs> what was the question again? <laughs> just, just first time golf trip. Uh, I mean, obviously we, you know, we know each other beyond the golf DMV stuff, but just like you know, how is it? You know, getting down here, the golf, all the stuff we're doing, et cetera, et cetera. That's good stuff, man. It was uh, good people, good vibes, good golf. Well, <laughs> hasn't been a lot of good golf, man, but it's been a, you know, it's been a great experience, man. It's been wonderful. The um, I was uh, as you guys were talking about it. I was looking at the the Golf Digest Top 100 list that came out. Right, and it was interesting because it's like you know, Tobacco Road is so polarizing. But like out of all the courses, Golf Digest said that that would be the highest rated. That's the highest rated. Yeah, them. yeah. The only one that's in top 50. So I thought that was pretty interesting too. That was my. That's been my favorite so far. Yeah. Okay. And you got to knock it off your list. And I got to knock so it off my from list. a golf perspective, uh, somebody says, "Hey, I'm coming down to play." You know, three or four of these courses next year. Based on you know, we haven't hit mid pines yet, but based on your experience so far, what would you tell them to work on? Like, what what do they need to be focusing on? I don't know, man. I, I, th- I think I'm in the LB camp of uh, Donald Ross, man. So oh, <laughs> gotta, whoa, whoa, okay. <laughs> no, that, that, that guy, another man. convert. That guy, man. <laughs> uh, I, too I, too I, too brutal on the approaches. You think? My, my thing, man, is like you know, like I know you've been aware, but I've, I've been putting pretty well. Yes, but not here. Um, yeah. So <laughs> um, for, the, for the past few months, right? But but you know, you come here and it's 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 just a whole different beast, man. And it, it was the same issue um, at you know Southern Pines. The same thing I had here. Same issues I hear at Pine Needles. So I put a little bit better Tobacco Road, but yeah. I don't know. It's, these two courses have got me today, man. Yeah. Okay. One of the things that's been crazy, um, and I've, I've talked about this before. Uh, with uh, Matt, with uh, Lou, with Glenn, and with Mike, is just how fast you guys have, you know, gotten good at the game. Like earlier this year, you broke eighty. Yep. yep. And like, where did you break eighty? It was like first one was at Oak Creek. Yeah. See, see the first one. Yeah. And then he's got. Ma- see, you know what I'm saying? Uh. Like, and these are things that has not happened in my life yet. And so, um, like, talk about your journey, like, because you've picked up golf in 2020, right? Or I think it was the end of. Yeah, the very end okay. of 2019. 2019. Okay, the very end of 2019. Yeah, and like, so to to from that point on until you know, and and this was all early 2024 to break 80 in such a short span. Mm-hmm. Talk about just that journey to getting like where you are. Yeah. So um, you know, firstly, you know, me and don't you know, are you going to give all? I, I, honor I, I, I thought you were going to say, say first you're first you're give all glory to God <laughs> for, make, for, for, for making the putts go in. <laughs> I thought she was our Lord and Savior. Thank we you. We talked about that. 
No, I was gonna say I was gonna give you know you know my brother Lewis shout out right because like one it's I think it was good to start with someone right mm-hmm. so at the same level and then like you know having like a competitive someone that can kind of <laughs> go ahead go ahead and say it well, have, having someone that can anymore. having someone that can you know competitively push each other because. We first started, right? Lou was, you know, a little bit better than me, and mm-hmm. then I, we keep going back and forth with the handicap. So you guys think, are pretty competitive too, yeah, right? so with like, each other. Lou <laughs> <laughs> said not anymore. So, so that was one thing. But then, um, one you, you always hear people talk about it, man. But like having um, a coach, right? Getting a coach was so instrumental, man, because knowing what you do. Being able to understand what you're doing wrong to be able to fix it on the fly, it's 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 invaluable, man. Is so, your coach left-handed? No. Okay. Nope. Nope. He's not. I try to blame all my right handed <laughs> coaches for why I still think, but obviously that's not the problem. <laughs> yeah. So you know, just just it's really you know having you know uh, an athletic sports background, and then you know this 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 sport is intoxicating, man. It's uh, it's it, you wake up thinking about it, go to sleep thinking about it, man. It's uh, it's it's there's no sport that's this rewarding and punishing at the same time. <laughs> yeah. It's played, man. It's, yeah. it's, it's nothing like The word it. is frustration. Frustration. Yeah. 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 There you go. yeah. And yeah. unlike, and I feel like unlike any other, even, even over tennis, any other solo sport, it's unique in that. So in tennis, at least there's an opponent. You can just, you can, can see, oh, well, he's got it today. I don't have it. There's no one to look at. Yeah. Right. So, uh, there's no one to look at but you. <laughs> yep. As we all do. We hit a bad right. shot and then look around like somebody was, you know, did something. We'll look at the club. Yeah. We'll yeah. look yeah. at yep. the grass. Yep. Like, nope. Ah. Nope. It's just it's, you. And it's, it's just you. you have yeah. to live with that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. And then you yeah. just get upset eventually. It's like you can blame something. It's like this this golf ball's about to get it, man. Just toss the golf ball. <laughs> it's, it's golf ball's fault. Yeah. yeah. Matt also, I think, has um, one of the funniest blow up moments this year, right? What's that? Because, like, Matt's usually even kill yes. when he's playing. So, like, Queenstown? Yeah. I think that was last year. I think it was last year. Explain it. Yeah. yeah. You first explain to what happened, and then Matt, the after best. Vern explains what happened, tell us what was it, going. It was. Again. It was the best. I think Rick was there. Like, <laughs> I think I want to say you got on a regulation. Got on a, a regulation. Yeah, Queenstown. Yeah, like on the back nine or something like that, and had couldn't have been maybe six, seven, eight feet, something like that. <laughs> no, no, it was. A, I think it was a on a regulation. I think it was a. Um, like a like a four foot putt. <laughs> oh, see, I I, I I tried to help him out. Made no, it no, four no, feet. No, I, I'll, I'll take my lumps. It yeah, was, it was like a four foot putt. Yeah, <laughs> just just right outside of gimme, right? It yeah, was maybe like three and a half feet, and uh, you know, it was uh above the hole and uh, tap it, and then it just rolled. And then like Berm was like up up up, so I had to had to go back right. Mm-hmm. So went from uh, uh, missed that one. So went from a uh, birdie to bogey. Um, very very quickly, man. So it was, yeah, wasn't it, wasn't yeah, it like watching him tap and then tap and then tap <laughs> and then. But that wasn't so he's being so like that happens and then like the whole time it's just you know we've all seen like we've all had mistakes in golf and right. when it goes going poorly you just don't say anything it's just like oh you know that sucks and he just very quietly picks the ball up it throws it with all of his might into the into the Chesapeake Bay and it like st- it caught us off guard we like had to step back because like, oh. there was nothing indicating that this dude's yeah, about to blow up he like just, <laughs> just very calmly picked it up and sent it into into the this or whatever. Man, it's so, like you could be walking from the restaurant to the room with Matt and then suddenly he just punches you in the face. It's like, I had no clue that you was upset. Like, yeah, yeah. it's just something, like, because usually you can see it building and building. Okay, so like, so the only guy that's not here right now is Aaron, right? And, and Aaron, by the way, well, Southern Pines. I just texted Pine and asked him to come up. Shot a 79. Yes. I mean, mm-hmm. killing 79 it. at Southern Pines. Yeah, yeah. 79 at Southern Pines. Kill, and uh, not so much at um, Tobacco. No, not so much at so at after, pine needles. after Tobacco Road. Aaron says, "I'm going to I'm I'm going to the." Uh, as a matter of fact, someone just knocked on the door. I think it's Aaron. There oh, he is, Aaron. Come right, on, Aaron, come, come to the mic. Come to the mic, yeah, Aaron. We were, we were just talking about you, yeah. Matt. Thank you so much for participating in this, in this in this edition of oh, in this edition of Golf DMV. Yeah, we'll have you right here. We want to talk about. We want to talk. I see. This is going to be a joke. We want to talk about your the the the. the um, the tra- the store stuff, like you know, so because you, you ended up you ended up going to um, number one. Shout out for the seventy nine at Thank Southern you. Pines. Thank you, very ridiculous. Much. Thank you. Thank um, you. But then, <laughs> so after Tobacco Road, mm-hmm. um, you you said I'm going to Golf Galaxy. Right. Explain what happened on your way to Golf Galaxy and how everything. <laughs> Okay, all right. I was about a quarter of the way to Golf Galaxy. We want there you go. Okay. I was about a quarter of the way to Golf Galaxy, and I thought, what am I doing? This is crazy. Reason kicked in. Right. Mm-hmm. So I turned around, made a U-turn, was planning on coming back to Pine Needles, and thought, well, maybe I'll go by Dick's. Mm-hmm. Just close by and see what they have. So I did, and uh, 
I end up talking to a guy in there and hitting in the bay and on track, man. And <laughs> I ended up buying a Ping G430 driver. <laughs> right. Was well, gonna get it regripped, but I said, let me try the grip. And if not, <laughs> I'll bring it back today, which I did. Right. <laughs> and then I bought a putter because I didn't putt very well. Right. Yeah. <laughs> what, what, what a reasonable person would do. Right. Right. Yeah. Right. But what I love yeah. is how Aaron, but he brought both, both drivers out of pine needles. Yes. And yes. was alternating holes. Like yeah. one hole, he's hitting with the new one, then the old one, new one, yes. old one, giving it an equal shot. Right. I'm comparing the stats now. So and after now, we finish this, I got to go back and look at the stats. And after we're done, <laughs> but this is the thing you love because golf does this to you. After we're done the round at pine needles, Aaron says, I'm buying a new putter. Right. We're all on the 18th green waiting for everyone to finish. Aaron is walking to the car with his God. Clubs. You're not playing, bro. No, we took pictures. Aaron's in none of the pictures. Aaron, Aaron wasn't at lunch. Like Aaron I meant like, what I said. He, yeah. I'm going to he said, die. I'll so, see y'all later. Yeah. I'm about to go get right. it. And he right. went to go get the new putter. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yes. yeah. So we'll break it in tomorrow. They, and break, break yes. it in tomorrow. Break yes. it in the well, man, at Pine yes. Needle. Yes. <laughs> yes. So, <laughs> so, so we just we just got Matt's uh, uh, thoughts on the mm -hmm. three that you've played so far. Somebody's okay. looking, looking forward to coming down here next year. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, say they haven't experienced Ross before and they want to play tobacco roll too. Like based on your just experience so far, what would you what would you tell them to work on? Like what do they need to be focused on? Work work on your approach game into okay. the green. Okay. And uh, definitely work on your short game. Okay. Definitely the chipping and learn how to putt <laughs> off the green. I mean, 20, so, so, 30 so, yards. So get, off the get green. like yeah. a good right. bump and run. Right. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. And learn how to use your putter. From 10, 15 yards off, because yeah. I think it'll save you strokes. Yeah. It's not as severe here in Southern Pines as number two, of course. No, two, but down, it yeah. will help. I mean, you know, I mean, as bad as I played today, it w it was only it only got real bad when I tried to use a gap wedge, a sand wedge, a nine iron chipping when I should have just used a putter. Yeah. It would have mm -hmm. been on the green. Yeah, mm -hmm. I would. It would have saved me a stroke, at least one stroke. Yeah, but when I tried to get cute. Trying to chip something off this tight grass yeah. that'll eat your club up. Yeah. I dropped two more strokes. Yeah. <laughs> right. Then I you, took out my putter. You know, you know who's not here for cuteness? Who? Donnie. Yeah, oh. Donnie. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm yeah. not here for not that. For sure. I want the yeah. ball on the green right. in the yeah. center. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, You get your two putts right. and you get out. And get out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. I reimagine right. Donnie's like a New York mouth or something. So <laughs> Southern Pines, Tobacco Road, mm -hmm. Pine Needles. Mm -hmm. How would you rank them? Um, yeah. I would rank them Pine Needles, Southern Pines. And then Tobacco Road for me. Yes. Okay. Uh, for me, I mean, Tobacco Road was in great condition. Uh, I guess um, I don't know. I just like the other two courses. I just like the other two courses. Yeah. And uh, for the architect who's a lot younger than um, who Strance? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Than Donald well, Ross. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He didn't think about. I mean, I guess I'm being biased. The Walkers at all. You know, I hate oh, to yeah, walk. Oh yeah, you are the only one. Yeah yeah yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, you know, and there was no different right, path for you. Right, yeah. right, right. But the course itself, I mean, I like the course. I just played bad. It wasn't the course. It wasn't, you know, he did anything unfair. You right. Know? I mean, I love all three of them, but just personal preference, it would be Pine Needles, yeah, Southern Pines, mm -hmm. and then Tobacco Road. Tobacco for Road. Me, for yeah. Me, that's okay. All. Okay. But awesome. I would recommend all three of them to anyone who comes down here. Oh, you know? all right, all right. Uh, when you stepped through to Carolina Hotel, did you miss Pinehurst number two yes. at all? Immediately. <laughs> Immediately. <laughs> did you? It was emotional for me. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm dead serious. Yeah. When I drove up and saw that opulent building, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm thinking, we staying over in this bullshit over here? <laughs> I miss this. <laughs> that, I mean, that's exactly what I yeah, thought. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, like, yeah. I remember what we did three years ago. <laughs> yes. We staying in this yeah, yeah. wood all over the place. No, no offense, but I mean, that. Oh, it so it's not so your vibe. Nice. It's not yeah, your thing. Exactly. It's not, yeah. No. <laughs> I mean, that was so no. nice. So are you, are you saying you don't like the family? <laughs> no. <laughs> no, no, no. My wife would hate this. She would be like, what is this? No, yeah. but I'm just saying, Pinehurst, like I was telling you, I was telling, I think, Vern and uh, uh, LB, oh, LB yesterday, uh, Claude, at dinner. I mean, I did not know. You know, I had just recently met you guys. It was less than a year in. Yes. Oh, yeah. When we Before put this we trip, trip together. Yeah. Y'all yeah. yeah. knew each other. Yeah, I yeah. was the fourth wheel. Yeah. And I was a little bit apprehensive about 
going six hours away from home yeah. to stay four days with you guys. I wonder. Dudes you don't even know. Right. Like, right. how's the any action going to be? Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know, how's everything going to go? How did I it? Mean, how did it go? Yeah. Personally, it went great. Okay. I thank came you. For the golf. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just curious what he's going right. to follow it up. No, with. I'm just saying. I don't care if y'all have even talked to me. All I want to do is play golf. Yeah. <laughs> I don't even care about that. But it was. We had a great time. Okay. Good. That's to, what I was. <laughs> like, everyone see. I mean, well, y'all seem to gel with me. I seem yeah. to gel with you. We sure. had the greatest time, yeah. and it was. That was the golf trip for me. I don't care where I go. I can go to Bandon with y'all. We can go to Scotland. That is going to be. That's why Pinehurst is the greatest on earth to me because I had such a good time with three guys who I listen to a podcast. Barely I right. come to Maryland a yeah. few times yeah. to yeah. play, mm-hmm. yeah. but boom. Let's go to Pinehurst for yeah. four days. Shop and my wife was like, are you sure? And I said, yeah, I guess so. <laughs> you sure I these said, niggas ain't trying right. to rob you? You know. <laughs> right. I said, brother, see all right. You know, we'll see how it goes. I'm, gl- I'm, gl- you know? I'm glad it worked out. But no, but I mean, I just, I'm, I'm telling you. it was, yeah. it, it, it was your Yeah, right. <laughs> I mean, I'm just saying, it was memorable for me. Yeah. It was a memorable trip, and I had a excellent time. Good, good. Nice. Yeah, so. Good. I also think this might be the first time that Lou's Lou. been on. Lou, come on up here, man. Come on, Lou, Lou grab this mic. Grab yeah, this yeah. mic, Lou. Oh, I keep getting up. Right? I want to ask yeah, Lou told something me six times. Uh, specifically. <laughs> where's Where's my meeting? Dot com. You all right, man? We don't care yeah. about that. We gotta get Lou here. Where's my meeting? Dot com. Where's uh, my meeting? Dot <laughs> com. Uh, one quick thing before we get out of here, Lou. Cause I wanted because I wanted to get so. We talk to everybody about the golf, you know, and um, just hearing Aaron talk a little bit about the Pinehurst experience or whatever. This is the first time. It's something that people may not know. Oh, well, I guess we just did the show um, when we did the Bandon thing and even the Pinehurst thing. Um, we probably mentioned it. But when um, you go on one of these trips, like people may not know just how I, th- I think gifted Vern is when it comes to, you know, like, um, you know, the sentimental stuff. You know what I mean? Like uh, he puts together little bags. For well, the first time, for everybody, <laughs> like he has to do it every trip, which he shouldn't. But he does these things where he'll put together like a bag or a box or some sort of gift for people, and 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 he does all these things. And I believe he did one for you, right? He did. Like, yes, yeah. he did. Vern's super talented. I I told him I Who thought he telling? should. I told him I thought he should go into <laughs> business. You know what I mean? Like he should do this as a thing, whether people got a trip or someone's spouse or something's got you know something they want to do special for somebody, and he could put together these packages and stuff. Um, because they're really, really good, and you got a chance, I think, to experience that this year. I did. It was um, one of the nicest things anyone's ever done for me. Like, mm-hmm. I mean, that was just a, a really special thing. Um, we got a bunch of gifts, you know, things that were that me and him had talked about. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. That you know, he 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 gave me kind of as a present, as as kind of breaking in my, I guess. Yeah, first trip, first all trip that. Type, yeah, yeah, welcome, like, da, da, da. yeah, yeah, yeah. And um, yeah, it was just it was awesome, man. It was um. I, I was talking about it. I was like, my wife wouldn't even do this for me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, you know, <laughs> yeah, I'm yeah. just kidding. She would, but I'm just yeah. like, she like, would, uh, she would try. She would try. She would be as good as Vern is at it. Yeah, I mean, you honestly. know, just, no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. So I'm kidding. I'm kidding. You're gonna I'm see him in this video a jump cut from my <laughs> wife would. <laughs> my wife jump cut. would do something like this, and it would be good. Uh, <laughs> no, nah, it was just it was super awesome. Like and and like I said, there were things that like me and him had talked about. Yeah. And then on top of that, he like had a uh, you know, a QR code to a video where like he's welcoming us individually to the trip. Yeah. And you know, t- explaining each gift, you know, in detail. And it was just like I was like, man, this is very well done. It's That's that awesome. was just a, it was, it's, it's top notch. I, like, I, I, yeah. I will I will say I I, I appreciate it. I'm glad you liked it because like put it together, especially for you and Matt, because like I said, I I, I kinda joked out about the end of each video. I was like, I've only known him for like a year and a half. They might see this and be like, man, what's this cornball? What's this, what, what is this nonsense <laughs> doing? So the fact that like the, the message is hit that whatever it's yeah, supposed yeah, to because I mean, look it's, it's not even that much it's just like hey man you know uh, you know driving all this away yeah, it, it seems like so, it's not that yeah. much yeah it's, it seems like but, but it's so unexpected like yeah, even, it's unexpected yeah. and it's very yeah. thoughtful yeah. 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 yeah yeah I mean I didn't do it <laughs> Lord, the, <laughs> what did you say Jamal from up? Uh, listen man <laughs> so, yeah, so Jamal's upstairs <laughs> Um, I don't think he's filling in for Wendell, down, right? Man. He is filling in for He is filling in for Wendell, who did get who. I, unfortunately, you hear us talk about it on the show. I had I, had, I brought Wendell his locally to his house. Oh, you I, did? Yeah, yeah. Because I, I had him for Dang. all three. Because Wendell yeah. didn't cancel until like Less. three days right. before. Yeah. And you so, took it to his house? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I brought it to his house. Gave him some. Yeah, but extremely. So cool. next year, Jamal, I'm telling you, Wisconsin, brother, Wisconsin, 2024. <laughs> 
<laughs> so, <laughs> so, so like, it, it, better better be, be it better be good. <laughs> hey, listen, you listen, make me listen. Cry. For everybody who listens to the show, again, we want to grow the group, reach out, golf DMV. But uh, you know, this might be the like, Jermon, You might be the last one. This is getting costly. By the way, it's expensive, man. We can't keep doing it. Email yeah. golf DMV if you got a, a trip coming up and you want to do something special for your group. Yeah, Fern can put it together. I can for help you, you out. For, I can help you, uh, out. you know. For well, I won't say small fee. Yeah, so, yeah. For a for a, for a fee. Yeah. <laughs> for for so, a fee. So same question to you, Lou, about the golf. Like like, what do you think so far? Favorites, not so favorite. Uh, not so favorite was Southern Pine. Um, I had a lot of thoughts about that. That I I, I don't want to take too much time on the podcast tonight. But um, <laughs> yeah. It, the my main thing with Southern Pine was that the greens were inconsistent. Yeah. Now I know that it might have been the grain and all that stuff, but like. Just, well, and, and it's new. That's the, uh, learning that, like, I guess they're still growing into. Yeah, but, like, yeah. you know, you go from hole to hole and one super fast, one yep. super slow. I just, yep. I can't deal with that. And I can't deal with that plus undulation plus not being able to see the hole <laughs> yeah. when you get there. Like, the, all those three approaches. things, you know what I'm saying? It's yeah. just a little bit too much for me. Yeah. Um, Tobacco Road, that was that was a lot of fun. That was um that was, that was was a wacky course that I I thought I, I was a little apprehensive about, but I really, really I ended up enjoying it. Um. Mm. Pine needles, I'd probably echo the sentiments of some of y'all. It's probably my favorite. Yeah. Like, it was just, it's just, you know, I was talking to Glenn about this. It's like smooth jazz. Very you know classic. Like, mm-hmm. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Classic golf. It's like, nice yeah. test. I like it. It's yeah. what you think when you think North Carolina golf. Yes. It, that, that's yes. exactly what yeah. you mean. Yes. Like, very pristine. At a like, resort. Yeah. I lo- I, so, I really, I really like uh, pine needles. Mm-hmm. But, uh, yeah, I mean, I, and I was talking to Matt about this. Like, you know, this this scratched the itch for us that we had we had been wanting for a long time okay and so you know just kudos to you guys for for uh, setting this up and just you know having the amount of guys to come out here to hear yeah like i mean man we can go anywhere you know what i mean like sure. like uh i know y'all y'all did bandit and y'all did pinehurst but like you know the tradition of this every year every other year whatever it's gonna yeah. be yeah yeah you know we're just happy to be here and uh really really enjoying ourselves yeah yeah, yeah. nice yeah. i want to get coach b over here for a quick second I want him to explain, talk about his YouTube he channel. for a second yeah, like he didn't yeah. know his name was called. <laughs> <laughs> I want to talk to Coach B real quick. And then unless anybody else got anything else they want to say, you know, feel free to grab the mic. If not, we'll, we'll, we'll end the show. So you, big North Carolina fan, Tar Heels, fan. being this close to Chapel Hill, how do you feel? <laughs> well, I feel like I'm at home. There uh, it is. <laughs> I was telling LB when um, we played yesterday, when we pulled up to, to drop the bag off, all the guys were they were just you know freaking out over the golf bag because it's, right. it's a UNC bag, mm-hmm. so it's a good day. <laughs> right. It's a good day. <laughs> right. I love it. Now, how did you feel about the golf? Because I think this might be the coach be coming with us tomorrow, but this might be your first golf trip with. Uh... No, it's first time with us. With yeah. All of us. Yeah. 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 Um, I mean, you got your whole other thing with the you know. Yeah. Yeah. Today, I, and I won't be with y'all the Myrtle Legends one time. Yeah. I didn't do the first day with you guys. Mm-hmm. I came here, but you know, um, I'm old. So I, I I can't do four days of back to back back not not the way you young cats do it. right. So I came down. I was probably here shortly after you teed off, but mm-hmm. I was out here, took my time, got on the range, oh, okay. did some things okay. like that. Yeah. Um, I did not like Tobacco Road, and it didn't like me. Right. Yeah. Right. Mutual. Yeah, it was mutual. Now, I liked the one we played today, although I played worse. Yeah. Does mm-hmm. that make sense? Yeah. You know yeah for I mean? sure. I, yeah. I enjoyed it. I couldn't do everything that I the putting. Uh, it, it would be there, and I, w- I was talking to Rick about it. I'm on. Oh, I'm not on. You yeah, understand? Were, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and you see it roll mm-hmm. to where it's going. Yeah, yeah. Frustrating. Frustrating. Yeah, Frustrating. Yeah, but yeah. I enjoyed it. I like that one the most. All right. All right. So, you, it, so Pine Needs like the most. Tobacco, he wasn't with it. So yeah, we'll see what happens. We got we'll see what happens tomorrow. Yeah. yeah. You yeah. know, I, I think I know what to expect. But this one, to me, this course was would make the, the trip worthwhile. Okay. Uh, All right. Yeah. With LB on the accommodations. And, and then, uh, not so much. yeah, accommodations, not so much. Uh, a real quick note from the trip planner for the accommodations. Again, when I send out the email, <laughs> when I send out the email for Pinehurst and it's $3,500 and I get quick, it's, uh, you know, this is what do you get with your pay? Get paneling. This is what we get. <laughs> now, <laughs> it exactly. Now, I do want to say, and I think everybody would agree with this real quick because you guys heard us talk about, you know, the Southern Pines, the Consistent Greens, Tobacco Road, you know, Lever Hate It, Pine Eagles is number one. That seems to be the vibe. Staying for all of the whatever's going on with the accommodations here at Pine Needles, even in my old dusty room, being able to walk out, 
the driving range, a, a beautiful oh, practice yeah, 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 area yeah, yeah, yeah. is right outside mm-hmm. in your yeah. backyard. Sure. You can wake up in the morning, especially if you're around here. Wake up in the morning, walk out with your bag. Just take your bag out, right out the back door. Mm-hmm. Walk to the range and just start hitting. Yeah, Go good. putt. You know, 50 do it. Yards, the, yards, you have Fifty yards. There's a there's yeah. a, a short par four or a short four the hole. Loop. The loop. The yeah. loop. Yeah. On the backside. Yeah, Matt and I played that this morning. You can just go do that anytime. Yeah. It is cool, and it, and you can just post up like to where LB was saying. We uh, sit outside and you know have drinks and and, uh, and whole court. When you post up out there during the day, you can see the range. You can see eighteen. You know, yeah. you're saying way way off to the side, and you just out there and chop it up. You know, and and, mm-hmm. and watch people play. So the the close access to pine needles, and I think even mid pines is only across the street. So you can like just basically hop in a cart and go. I do like the resort part of that. I do appreciate that. Obviously, again, oh, sure. we'd, we'd like to update some of this, but you yeah, know, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. So I, I do want to say because that is cool. Like to be able to walk yeah. outside. Now, just to be clear, yeah, I, I know we've all talked about the accommodations, but again, to your point, given the price point, yes, you can't expect but so much, yeah, from the accommodations. Yeah, four days golf and lodging, sixteen basically. Right. Yes. So I mean, I mean, I'm I'm not mad at the price at all. You know, I just know next time bring a can of rate. And yeah, good. there you go. You know there I mean? you go. There you go. Yeah, yeah. Coach B, yeah. tell everybody about your YouTube channel. Um, I have a YouTube channel, Rusty Brown Photography, um, that I do some stuff on. I produce a podcast called Have You Seen It? Seen It is S C E N E, which is a movie review channel. And then I host uh, 15 Good Minutes. Um, and that's one that I do with some guys similar to you guys, but we, you know, we just kind of chop it up about whatever's going on in the week. That's what we do. Please check out Coach B's YouTube channel. Yeah. Before we close things down, Mike, Rick, Glenn, y'all got anything out? Troy, anything y'all want to say? Or Any testimony good? from the congregation? <laughs> At the church statement. Oh, yes, you like this course, right? Yeah, I do like this one. Okay, so you good with Donald Ross, man? Mm. We, Donald mm. Ross, mm. Donald oh. Ross mm. and I have a love-hate relationship. <laughs> so today we okay. Oh, okay. We okay. It's complicated. Yeah, it's complicated. It's complicated. It's complicated. Yes. Yeah. 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 One, one, but one more thing I wanted to say when you talked about the practice, things to practice before you come here. The two things I would say, which is it's hard to do at home, with home being the DMV, is hitting off pine straw. Yeah. Because when your ball goes off the fairway, it's going to be sitting on some pine straw. So you. Try to practice that if you can, and just practice a lot of sand shots, a lot of oh, sand yeah, shots, because you're going to be hitting <laughs> from sand from everywhere. Yeah. So just yeah. all over the place. practice, over. and not and it's not crazy. just bunker, but long oh, shots. Yeah. You know, trying to hit Link seven to irons, mm-hmm. right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, mm-hmm. hit any, yeah, long irons, short irons, hit out of the sand. Practice that stuff because you're definitely going to need that. Anytime you come to any course of North Carolina, yeah. you're going to need that skill. Okay, there you go. There you go. All right, y'all. So we'll be back. When we come back next week, we'll do Mid Pines. Um, it's getting close to 8 o'clock local time. Right, and minutes. there's, um, yeah, it's show number 300. Yeah, several, Gentlemen's Ballet is tonight. Several festivities happening later tonight. <laughs> uh, various of uh, several options. And uh, so we'll, yeah. we'll close with, 300. <laughs> with that. 300, show y'all. 300. That's show it. 300. Congratulations. 300. Shout out to our people at Podcast One. Uh, Federal News Network, Hubbard Broadcasting, for all the love on 1500 AM and mm-hmm. on Podcast One, um, and to all of our sponsors throughout the years That's as right. well. Where's my uh, meeting? But then we've got a shout out as, as well. Where's my meeting? Uh, Lou Naylor, where's my meeting.com. As a matter of fact, yeah, I mean, I just even look at the room. Like, I look at the people who are part of the crew because they listen to the show. You know what I mean? Yeah. And that's what, that's what we try to do. There we go. All right, yeah. All right, so. We'll be back next week. Yep. Southern Pines. I mean, Mid Pines. Yeah. And all that And the whole full trip review. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And all that stuff. Show 301 next week. (laughs) Yeah. Show 301 (laughs) will be next week. All right, y'all.